Hello from AWPS. I'm just going to do a quick video of an unvented cylinder and a combi boiler installation. Uh, the reason I've got a combi boiler is because the cylinder has only just been installed. The combi, I had a combi before, where that pipe works going down directly below that is an airing cupboard. So I've now moved everything to the loft. This is the loft. So now, uh, the reason for the cylinder is because I'm going to put in solar panels. So I'm going to use the solar energy to heat the hot water. Okay, let's go in and have a quick look. <coughs> right. So, <clears throat> the boiler at the moment is direct, direct hot water is turned off. This lever valve is turned off, so the... the the hot water is coming from the cylinder. I can have it back on to the combi by turning this valve off and opening this valve and it can go back to combi mode. So I've got the best of both worlds. I've got an S plan. So it's two motorized valves, one controlling hot water, one controlling central heating radiators. A system filter to just clear the debris from the boiler important safety devices which is the expansion vessel temperature and pressure relief valve expansion relief valve come around a bit <clears throat> so if it's temperature or pre temperature related that will spew out like that If it's expansion related, it will be more of a trickle. Just like that. I'll just stop that. So, and these are important safety devices. And this is a pressure reducing valve with an on return valve. And the expansion vessel, so when the cylinder is heated, this takes up your expansion. So I can isolate the hot here open this, turn the combi back on, and then we can bypass this. Obviously shut this down to stop it filling up. So we can put it back to combi mode if required. Let's go into the combi boiler. Right, so this is a Worcester 2000 with a vertical flue, a hot ton um, for the PRV, frost protection just there this is my automatic filling non-return valve to stop any back siphoning going back into the water main all lagged except I've got to do a bit more lagging I've only just installed this cylinder so I'll um, I'll get round to finishing the lagging if I come round here Excuse me, I've got to get underneath. This is where my, all the wiring is. I've got to tidy that up, which I will do. Um, that's it, really. So, so this cylinder all, all complies with building regulations. Obviously, it needs to be lagged, so I'll get that done ASAP. There's previous lagging because the boiler was already installed, so it's partially lagged. And that's the life of AWPS. Hope you enjoy this video and thank you very much.